Trapper have just appeared and we're still a long way till then. But we finally arrived at the pudding pie and there's a girl. Hmm. She has a ribbon on her neck. Interesting. Stop throwing the trash. Oh! Sheriff, what a nice surprise. I'm not sure I've seen you here before. I don't think You're I've always seen. welcome, of course. Is it business or pleasure? Or both? I'm a friend of Georgie's. Where is he? A friend? <laughs> <laughs> she, she You're in me. luck. He's here. Come on. Yeah, probably it wasn't the best answer. Oh, the door is locked, but I, I should they warn know you that Georgie does not like to be bothered when he's working. Okay, thanks. And he's in kind of a mood right now. I mean, more so than usual. It'll be fine. I have a way with people. Yeah. <laughs> so I've heard. <laughs> Let's go in, Big Big. Welcome to the Pudding and Pie. Thank you. Where we cater to the diverse tastes of the Fable community. Your pleasure is our pleasure. Your desires are our desires. Your imagination is the menu. And discretion is our guarantee. Did you know Lily? She worked here. <sighs> My lips are sealed. You'd better ask Georgie. Oh god. What do you think you're doing? You look like you're trying to take a shit. Who's gonna want that? No one's gonna want that. Nice place. You do have a sense of humor. That's good. Thanks. Good luck. Oh god, I hope nobody wants It's your face. You have to smile. You never smile. How many times do I have to say it? Oh. You've seen me already. Oh, it's you. Yeah. We're closed. Really? Keep dancing, you. I didn't say stop. For fuck's sake. You, stay right there. Don't even think about sitting down. We're not finished. I got a few questions. Imagine my excitement. Yeah, I imagine. Come on, George, you don't be like that. What do you want, then? You here for a little taste? No. Tell you what, come back after midnight, maybe. I can hook you up. Or, uh, knowing you, she's probably not quite your style. Oh, God. You'd prefer someone who can take a bit of a beating. Tell me, do you prefer a stationary target, or one that will put up a fight? I'm okay. not here for that. Ooh, <sighs> I'm not here for that. <laughs> Just stopped in for the chips then. <laughs> Jesus, Big B, you're so corny. I love it though. No, seriously, I love it. Uh, he's a douche, but I guess it could be worse. Okay, all right, Sheriff. Just fucking with you. Yeah, I've seen this already. Look, I know why you're here. Who told you? Who told you? Listen, Sheriff. Around here, we can't afford to wait for you and your swanky pals to take an interest. We have to look out for each other. When shit happens, I hear about it. Who? Especially if it concerns my livelihood. In that case, I assume you knew Lily was glamour. Of course she was, you daft git. She was a troll. <laughs> no, I mean glamour to look like another fable. Yeah? Well, so what? Who gives a toss? People get up to all kinds of things when nobody's watching. You know, um, it's illegal to impersonate it. another fable. It's frowned on. It's illegal as long as I don't like it. Bigby does not the right answer. The 13th floor would never provide a glamour like that. It's strictly black market stuff. That's true. Ooh, black market, is it? How exciting. This is exactly what I would expect from a thug like you. Storm in, throw around a bunch of accusations, try to scare people. But you've got fuck all to back it up. But I'm not accusing anyone. And we're all just meant to jump any time the wolf shows his teeth. He used to be something, you know. 
What? I think I skipped. Why did I choose? Get that out of my face. This was part of the glamour we found on Lily's body. Take a good look. She was impersonating Snow White. Why? Oh, hey, if you say so. I'm Just sorry. looks like hair to me. Anyway, even supposing she was doing a special glamour, it wasn't for me. I don't need the trouble. Yeah, I think for who she's then? right. I don't know. She had clients. Maybe one of them was into it. A lot of fucked up people in Fable Town. I <laughs> like in any town, I guess. Try looking in the mirror. Oh. Anyway, now what to do with me? Stop the music, please. Go on, then. Oh, God, no. You're gonna hit me! Go in! That's what you wanna do, right? One more time. Who hired her? Yeah. Did he want to punch me? Oh no, fuck! I haven't done anything, so it's not my fault this time. This time, I said. You! Take your sad fucking face where I can't see it! God Bloody damn bastard it. Bastard fucking shit! I have to censor this video. You proud of yourself, mate. Proud of your little mess. But I haven't done shit. Fuck's sake. It's not my fault, really. At least not this time. Fuck off, Hans. Hans? Oh, like Hans and Grab. Oh. Hans. Hold on a minute. Hans, is it? Hans just cleans up and provides a little muscle when we need it. He's not gonna know anything about the girls and their clients or any of that. No one knows. Don't you get it? It's by design. Discretion is our guarantee, right? And the way we guarantee that is that no one knows anything they don't have to know. Interesting. Including me. I cover my eyes and take my cut. End of story. Why well, not look it up? What's that? Isn't there a little book with all the stuff about the girls and all that written You're in it? You're a fucking uh. moron. <laughs> Show me. There is no book. <laughs> and as for you, Hans, we need to work on your communication skills and have a fairly good idea where to start. Just hey, stop that, George. That's already. my personal property. Yeah. Tell me about the book. <laughs> sure, go ahead. Do what comes naturally. No, we're not going to do this. No. Tell me about the book. You haven't got the slightest clue about anything. <sighs> hey, now! I'm not going to destroy anything. I'm just Cut the crap, to be Georgie. Good. I want the book Hans is talking about. Hans is confused. No, he's Again. not. Don't even think about it. I don't want Look, Georgie, to destroy anything. Why don't you just tell me where the book is? Can we please not go round and round about this? There's no book. Stop End of lying. story. <sighs> Do I not wanna... touch that. You hear me? That's nothing to do with you. There's still One time, time for you to just cough it up. I'm just I'm trying sorry, to be Shimmy, good. But there's no Andy Magic book with everything you want to know jotted down inside. I sincerely wish there was. Maybe it would get you off me back. <laughs> yeah, I've seen. What is there? Well, well. What's this? Looks like a floor safe. Yeah, that's uh, what I wouldn't it looks know. like to me. It was here when we moved in. I don't have a key to it. Sheriff, oh, will you come on? Tear it apart. Fuck's sake, I've got to open up in a few hours. Give me the book, Georgie. Give it to me. You're a big bad bastard. We get it. Everyone's guilty. We fucking get it. I'm not accusing you. I'm just asking for Jesus. the book. Jesus, you're killing me. I'm begging you. I'll pay you. I don't need money. Two women are dead. Then quit being a bloody idiot. I will fucking destroy Come this place. It. Leave Crowd it. control. There's nothing there for you. Just give you them might want to stand team. back. All right, all right, all right. That's good. Uh huh. I thought you said it was here since you moved in. Bitch. Bloody come on, then! 
Bloody come on, dude. Prick. What'd you say there? You little Once scum. again, don't get your hopes up. There's nothing in here that'll tell you anything. But it's a kick to the balls for me and my club, so he can be happy about that. I think there was a l not a one Here, yellow there. This is Lily's last entry. So tell me, Georgie, who's this Mr. Smith? Oh dear. Snow White. Oh. I'm afraid it might be a fake name, Bigby. Secrecy is sort of how this all works. Even Ants knows that. What's 207? 207. Room number? I don't fucking know. Millimeters, maybe? Ah! Oh, shit me, Georgie. <laughs> this is your book. Your girl. I'm not their fucking secretary. <laughs> that was I a good one. I give them a stage. I give them music. I provide an erotic venue to attract and retain clients. But let's be clear on something. The girls make the arrangements with their clients, not me. The girls. They're the ones with the Mr. Smiths and Joneses and Mr. X types. Whatever happens outside the club, that's on them. I log the business, take my cut, and I'm out. I think now, he's not I've had quite this enough time. of you and your bullying. Excuse me while I call your superiors to make a complaint. Uh, but I haven't done anything. Why would you make a complaint? I mean it. Let's check that room. Hello? Business office? Shut the fuck up. Crane is too noob up to do something. I mean it. Hmm. Can't check in anything else. Let's go on the door. Open. Hmm. <laughs> Let's take it from this one. Faith, thanks for covering for me tonight. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. Lily. Lily. Looks like they both saw one of Lily's clients. That's interesting. Cosmetics. And a few Lipstick, coins. lip gloss, compact, glitter. Glitter. Cub, 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 what? Cub boy? Cub, ah, uh, cub boy, yeah. What? That was all, really? Uh, what do we have here? Cub boy. Uh, the same shit. But it's now empty because she's dead. Oh, Broken open. someone might but have. There isn't even a lock. Someone broke it. Lock's been what busted the? open. Yeah. Fucking rooms. Maybe you can find something else. Excuse me. Poor girl. I heard man. you out there. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. I think I've seen her before. Somebody else said that to me on the way in. I guess we're all surprised. <laughs> Lost cat again? Poor kitty, man. What's with the You're fucking trying to place me. Yeah, I've seen you before. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. What? Once upon a time. Does that help? What are you doing here? Same as anyone. It's a place where I am. Where else am I supposed to be? Anywhere but not here. What the fuck? My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. Of course you do. I don't have answers. You'll have to find those yourself. But what? She, she's a nice girl, I mean it. Mr. Smith, the last night, two seven. Does the number 207 mean anything to you? I assumed it was a room number, but where? At a hotel, or Motown. We or can't something. talk about work. Uh, this is a murder case. Sure was a I mean, can't. These lips are sealed. Discretion is our guarantee. That's something. It's how things work here. Something's bad. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? This is what I need to know about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? I have to know. I think something's These wrong with her. Lips. Our Sheriff team. Wolf, would you like to make an appointment with me? I think yes. Uh, okay.
Okay. Okay. What would I need to do? I need 150. It's not good to be short. Uh. Okay. This isn't enough, but it's all I've got. Wasn't Faith in need Wait of here for a second. bucks? Something... Something's really not where it's supposed to be. Not 207? You'll think of something. Oh, the open arms. Thank you. Hmm. This is where they met. Enjoy your stay. I hope you find what you're looking for. So George and you too. Wow. Something's really awkward about her. No standing anytime except what? Quick cash. Checks, cash, money, orders. Uh, is she? Oh. That's so sad. Sheriff? I guess you don't have to rush to I mean, a policeman and his wife to prostitute for money. Oh. That's really bad. But that was all for today's episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and see you next time.